Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons. Today I have prepared two easy questions for you. And the first question is vertical gene transfer is a process of genes being passed down from parent to offspring. Is it true or false? And actually this is true. Not much to explain here. You just have to memorize. So if we would use simple pedigree and you would see that genes are passed from parents to the offspring and we call this vertical gene transfer. Next question. When bacteria take up naked genetic material from the surrounding environment, this is called and we have five answers to choose from. Uh, this is basically general term would be uh, example of uh, horizontal gene transfer. So we can cross out vertical gene transfer right away. And I hope everyone would uh, also cross out answer E replication. This is not uh, replication. Answer C conjugation is basically uh, what we can say bacterial sex. When uh, bacteria come in the close proximity, in the direct contact and exchange genetic uh, material. And so we can cross out this answer too. Uh, now we have left with two answers that students usually mess up. So in order for you to memorize a difference between transformation and transduction, these two uh, words have the same uh, beginning, trans, what makes them difficult to memorize and uh, easy to mess up. But I have a mnemonic technique. This is not scientific explanation, of course. This is just mnemonic technique, how to memorize the difference. So, as you see, uh, transduction remind me, for example, duck. Here we have uh, duction, like a duck. Ducks can get, because ducks are birds, and they can get uh, viral disease, for example, bird flu, you know. But transformation, reminds me uh, transformers, robots transformers and robots cannot get viral disease. So transduction is a situation when two bacteria can exchange piece of uh, genetic uh, information uh, with the use of uh, bacteriophages. Actually uh, one bacteriophage can infect uh, one bacteria and then uh, many bacteriophages would be made and uh, those bacteriophages can um, also get uh, a piece of the DNA into the head, uh, DNA of bacteria and infect another bacteria also transferring uh, this genetic material. So another unrelated bacteria also can get, uh, say, resistance for some, um, for example, uh, antibiotics. And uh, this is how uh, horizontal gene transfer works uh, in transduction, what we call transduction. But transformation would be a situation when, uh, say, one bacteria dies and would leave her genetic material exposed and another bacteria would acquire this uh, piece of this uh, genetic material and again uh, this genetic material uh, can be a gene that would provide for example antibiotic resistance and so would uh, affect uh, fitness of this uh, bacteria. One more time transduction when uh, bacteria can get new genetic material through uh, specific viruses, which we call bacteriophages, and transformation when bacteria take up naked genetic material from the surrounding environment. So as you see, answer A. I hope my mnemonic technique would help you on exam. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Please write your comments, questions if you have any. Share this video with your classmates and see you in the next video. Goodbye.